Demons cannot hide where the anointing is, but they can elsewhere. Like, I mean, this is why just the world in general, they treat the symptoms, but they don't know the root. They call it sometimes genetics. They say, we don't know what causes this, but they can't fix the root. The roots can only be seen in the spiritual realm. This is what the devil loves to do, just to keep people in blindness. You think it's disorder. You think you need anxiety medicine. But really, it's demonic oppression just hiding. But when you come where the anointing is, demons can't stay. It's like fire or electricity is being sent to them. Like, get out. I love that. That's Jesus. He's just full of fire, power, electricity, this force. That's the love of Jesus. The love is so massive that it's the highest force of love. Power, explosion, electricity. That's love. It's dynamite. And so Jesus, he comes and he frees his people. He destroys those works of the devil. So when Jesus, his anointing is there, it's like it scans and finds wherever, wherever people are oppressed, wherever there's bondage and it boom, comes upon those nasty, evil demons. And those demons, they were comfortable before. They're comfortable, they're sitting there, they sit there for generations. But no more are they comfortable. Now they're being forced to get out by that fire. These demons can't stay where the anointing is.